Greetings, my friends. We are all interested in the future, for that is where you and I are going to spend the rest of our lives. You are interested in the unknown, the mysterious, the unexplainable. That is why you are here. And now, for the first time, we are bringing to you the full story of what happened on that fateful day. We are giving you all the evidence based only on the secret testimonies of the kids who survived this terrifying ordeal. The incidents, the places. My friends, we cannot keep this a secret any longer. Can your heart stand the shocking facts about invaders from Mars? TV. Maybe there's something on the news about it. Good idea! Good morning, California. It's a beautiful day and absolutely nothing strange or unusual happened on the hill behind Chip and Courtney's house last night. So with that, we wrap our show. Have a great weekend, everybody. That was weird. Chip, I have a funny feeling that something very strange happening. Uh-oh, you do? Think about it, Chip. We see a flying saucer duck behind the hill, just outside our house, and now it seems the news is covering it up. Uh-oh, I think I know where you're going with this. Chip, I think it's Martians. Martians? Yep. What are Martians doing here? Use your head, Chip. We've seen these movies before. The Martians are here to take over our planet. It's an invasion! What? Gee whiz, Courtney, you're starting to sound ridiculous. What's that sound? It sounds like it's coming from the window. Hello, Earthling. Martian! Chip, 
Come back here, Earthlings. I am a Martian ambassador. It's a good thing that Martian ambassador just run their ass. Where did you go, Earthlings? I don't think I can run anymore. It's okay, Chip. I think we outran him. Phew, that was close. I'm sorry I doubted you, Courtney. It's okay, Chip. I understand. I'm not sure I would have believed it if I hadn't seen it myself. Where do we go now? We need to find help and alert everyone that the Martians are here. We're close to the diner. We should go there. I think they have a phone we could use. A Martian will probably... Hey, what happened to the Martian anyway? I think he stopped running after us. That's weird. Why would he stop? He seems to be acting pretty funny. Do you think he... Wait. Whoa, look. Is that... Is that... Molly? Okay, that's pretty weird. Why is Molly talking to the Martian? And didn't she tell us she was going away to summer camp? Chip, I have a funny feeling about this. Oh, no. I was afraid you were going to say that. Remember that movie we saw where the Martians were hypnotizing the townspeople? Yeah? What if the Martians have hypnotized Molly? Yikes! You think Molly is helping the Martians? I don't know for sure, but I hope I'm wrong. Ah! They see us! Quick, let's run to the diner! <laughs> of light it knocked us out and when we turned on the news they said nothing unusual was happening behind the hill and then the martian ambassador was at our window he started chasing us but we outran him and if things couldn't get even weirder we saw the martian ambassador talking to molly we think she's under martian mind control you have to help us warn everybody whoa 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 guys what on earth are you talking about melody i know what courtney and i are saying sounds crazy I'll say it's out of this world. Exactly! The Martians are invading, and Molly is helping them. We don't have a moment to lose! Oh my goodness. Okay, you guys, this is nuts. First of all, there are no Martians. There's no such thing as flying saucers. And isn't Molly away at summer camp? Melody, you have to believe us! Hold on, I have an idea. Attention, everyone! The Martians are coming! They plan to invade Earth, and, and that's it. Well, that didn't work. I believe you guys. Mary Ellen. You do? Mm-hmm. Last night, as I was getting ready for bed, I just happened to look out my bedroom window, and there it was. A flying saucer hovering above my neighborhood. Whoa! You've got to be kidding. And I too thought Molly was away at camp. But strangely enough, I saw her just this morning. You did? What was she doing? I'm not sure, but when I approached her to ask why she wasn't at camp, she got very short with me. She said she was too busy to talk, that she was busy playing an invasion game or something. An invasion game? Was she with anyone? No, I don't think so. But she walked away saying something about Zero Hour being at 12 noon. Zero Hour? Oh my god! What zero hour? It's when the Martians begin their invasion! We'll be under attack! Well, I hate to break it to you guys, but it's 12 o'clock now. What is that? Sounds like the emergency alert siren. Is it an earthquake? No, it's not. It's worse. Everybody. Listen carefully. The Martians are coming this way. 
We must evacuate the city. World. Come on, back here. I think there's a back door. Calm down, everyone. It's best if we remain calm and stay inside the diner. I can't stay here. Let me out. No. You need to stay inside. Who knows what's going on out there. What in the world is that? Whoa! Is that a flying saucer? What is that? Oh my! What is that in the sky? Is that what I think it is? Oh! Triple no thumb la- What was that? Are you guys seeing this? Where do we go? Where do we go? Whoa! Here they come! The Martians! This is the invasion we were talking about. <gasps> Look, it's Molly! Huh? Whoa, is she leading the Martians? Oh my God. Uh, it looks like she's coming this way. She must be looking for us. Yeah, she definitely knows we're here. Quick, we need to hide. Hey, hey! Where did everybody go? I think they all ran out the back. Shh, shh. Here she comes. She's coming inside. Come out, come out, wherever you are. <gasps> I know you're in here. There's nothing to be afraid of. Everything will be all right. Just as long as you surrender to the Martians. <gasps> what was that? You guys okay? Huh? Wait, what? Whoa! In the world? Huh? <gasps> Molly? Hey guys! Okay, will someone please explain to me what is going on? Molly, I'm I mean you you are Molly, right? <laughs> yeah, it's me. Whoa, you sure are good with the paddle. Molly, if you're you, then who or what is that? He copied my likeness. They can do that? Oh, yeah. The Martians landed at Camp Kowanigan last night and started their invasion. Oh, my. I'll say. They ruined S'mores Night. The girls didn't take too kindly to that. <laughs> the Martians! Do you have any idea how much I was looking forward to S'mores Night? Take that! Take that! Take that! Take that! And that! And that! And that! The Martians! Their saucers, but the girls and I knew they would head for town and try to initiate their invasion here. We came as soon as we could. Well, Molly, you were just in time. Yeah, we were just about to be vaporized or something. Thank you, Molly. Molly, you are one brave girl. Aw, thanks, guys. I wonder if that's the last we'll see of them. Perhaps, but sooner or later, there'll be others. They're far more advanced than us. Uh.